Hello everyone, welcome to The Green Man. Hope you're doing good and well. So for the past couple of weeks, I've been compiling a list of my top 40 favorite songs of all time. This has been quite a difficult challenge, I mean, um, but not maybe as difficult as I was expecting, because there were quite a few songs which I just instinctively thought of straight away, I just knew would be straight, go straight onto the list. But then there were others I had to think about a bit more about you know, go back through my album collection and work out, are these songs, do they mean enough to me uh, to go onto a top 40 list of all time? So this is what I'm going to be doing anyway for this, uh, you know, this series of uh, shorts videos. I'm going to be posting these as short videos rather than, you know, you know long ones. Um, I'm going to be posting a song a day starting from my number 40 each day working down to my number one. There may be the odd exception, maybe where I don't post a song on a particular day for whatever reason, I don't know. I'm just going to allow myself that bit of um, flexibility because, I don't know, it might just be a bit crazy, 40 days straight, 40 songs, don't know. But anyway, what the rules are for this, you can join in with this. If you're a YouTuber, you are very welcome to join in. So this can be any genre, you can select a song from any genre. Um, you can't have more than one song from an artist, so when you've finished your top 40 list, there should be all different artists on that list, so not more than one song per artist. You can't choose a song as well that is less than three years old. I guess, to me, to say a song is your favourite of all time, I feel like you need at least kind of really more than three years, really ideally, I guess a few years, to be honest. But um, yeah, that's, that's, those are the rules. Um, so yeah, my list is pretty eclectic. I'm looking forward to sharing the song per day um, but yeah it's pretty all over the place you know there's stuff on here from 70s and 80s classic rock and heavy metal to um, more popular sort of pop music to indie music to you know more obscure extreme metal stuff as well obviously makes its appearance um, so it, <laughs> it's like the list of a madman for me basically but it was fun to do and interesting I think provides some insights into you know how what sort of songs connect with me, and if I see your lists, what sort of songs connect with you. Anyway, thanks very much for watching, as always, have great days, and uh, great Sundays, otherwise from me, take care, bye for now.